Now let's explore the admin dashboard. Think of the admin dashboard as your virtual portal into your school where you can add admin, teachers, students, and classes, control school-wide settings for use, review school analytics, and interact personally with the learning happening in your school. To access the admin dashboard, click on my Seesaw for Schools Administrator. This is your admin dashboard. Each tab gives you unique tools for managing and engaging with your school. Get weekly engagement metrics on the Overview tab. Here you will see the total number of new posts, comments, likes, and parent visits appear across the top for the last seven days. In the recently added items, you can see a random sampling of 28 items that have been added over the past seven days. One of the quickest and easiest ways to start engaging in your school's learning is by engaging with a recently added post. You can like and or comment on a post directly from this page. This is a great first step to beginning to establish a presence in your online classrooms and start building a stronger relationship with teachers and students. This is also a great way to quickly see and celebrate those teachers that are highly engaged in Seesaw. As we saw earlier, teachers access the school and district library via the green add button in their Seesaw journal. You access your school and district activity library by clicking on this tab under admin tools. As a reminder, this is where you will find all of the activities that have been shared by teachers in your school or district. When you click Get Families Data and Invite Families, you can enable, disable, or let teachers decide to grant family access. From this point, there are two options. Let your teachers send the family invites via a link or printout, or the admin can download a CSV with connected family data and invite links for each student in the school. We recommend having teachers invite family members. In the Classes tab, you are able to see all family visits and posts added to a class over the past 28 days, as well as the total number of posts for each class. You can use the arrows under each metric to filter. You might want to filter by Post Added to celebrate classes going above and beyond, which classes are using Seesaw, and who has families connected. This is a great place to look and celebrate the successes of those classes and their efforts. From this tab, you can also visit and engage with specific classes by clicking on the name of the class. The Teacher tab shows you the last sign-in day for each teacher in your dashboard. You can also see which teachers are a part of your Seesaw professional learning community, such as ambassadors, Seesaw certified educators, and pioneers. You can reach out to your Seesaw leaders to brainstorm ways to support low-engaged teachers. From this tab, you can also visit and engage with specific classes by clicking on the name of the teacher. Either of these options will take you to the journal view for the class you selected. In the class view, you can scroll through the journal to see all the work posted to the class, or you can click on a student name on the right to view work by student. If you have a meeting with a parent and want to highlight the amazing work their student has been doing, you can easily find that student's work in one click. Here you can also virtually engage with student work by clicking the like button or leaving a typed or audio comment on a post. A like or a comment really can go a long way. Students thrive when they receive positive encouragement from the adults in their lives. Even a few interactions a day strengthens your relationships with students. You can easily switch back to your admin dashboard by clicking on the profile icon in the top left of your Seesaw admin dashboard and tapping on your dashboard name. Metrics in the Students tab help you see family engagement by student. You can search by student name and student ID and also click on the student's name to see their portfolio. In the Students tab, you may want to filter by connected parents to see which students still need a family member connected to their account. Then you can provide support to get those families connected. Metrics in the Families tab help you see connected family members. Click on a family member's name to view the family profile. We recommend that teachers directly invite families to connect. As an administrator, you can provide additional support if needed by bulk updating families. Follow the instructions to upload a list of family connections. Don't worry, if an existing family member appears on the import, admin inviting additional families with the bulk tool will not change anything for already connected family members. This saves teachers time and ensures all families have the opportunity to connect to their child in Seesaw. In the Skills tab, you can upload school-wide skills to support teachers using Seesaw for formative assessment. You can find and use our existing skills templates or you can create your own by following our guides in our help center. If you choose to upload skills to your dashboard, teachers will have the ability to tag skills to activities and you as the administrator will have the ability to go into a class and view progress by clicking the graduation cap. Here you can see how teachers are tracking mastery towards learning standards. For all time engagement metrics, click on the analytics tab. Here you can sort the data by date going all the way back to the beginning of the year. You can sort by term or year. It's amazing to see these numbers grow over the course of the year. In this tab, you can also track the number of family visits. You can see how these numbers change over the course of the term or year. 
This data allows you to understand in real time if you're meeting your family engagement goals for your school and understand Seesaw's impact on improving the home school connection at your school. A weekly email is sent to all school admin that highlights the engagement for the week. This allows you to see who is using Seesaw the most and who needs more support. Continue to part three to learn about Seesaw messages.